Welcome back to our Two Minute Tuesdays. Wait, it's a Thursday. It's, it's Thursday? It's a Thursday. What are we doing this on gotcha. a Thursday for? Ticka, ticka, two minute, two, two, two. It's a special holiday episode. It is a special Woo! holiday episode, yay. <laughs> because people sent in holiday questions and we had so many, we had to cut some out, but we, we had more that we wanted to keep than we had Tuesdays. Exactly. So here we are on so the Thursday. So here we are, all right. And we get to see another hat. That is so awesome. It's my favorite. Mary Pugmas. It's, it's a pug hat. That's I don't right. know if you, I hope you can see it. Mary yeah, Pugmas. That's awesome. Remember you wore that during Christmas Eve service last I year. I did. And brought the house down. Very good. <laughs> All right, today's question. Why is it hard for people to give the same amount of forgiveness to themselves that they give others and to relieve the stress on, stress on themselves the way they wish peace to others, especially at this time of year? Okay, that's, that's a good question. So here's the deal. Most of us, and I'd say most because I think the culture is changing. And it may be more my generation. I think millennials have gotten a little bit less of this and after millennials even less, which is making yeah. the older people grumpy because we grew up this way, why don't you? Right. But mm -hmm. most of us grew up learning this, mm -hmm. that our parents said, you know what? What you do is really important. I'm gonna call you to account for what you do, but I don't care about those other kids over there. They get grace and mercy, but you, you are my child and therefore I will come down on you. And it's very legalistic and whatever, which is not necessarily bad because this is how most of us learn how to look both ways before we cross the street and not get hit by a bus or something. And that's exactly what we internalized, that I have to follow X, Y, and Z, otherwise I will not be safe. Mm -hmm. But everybody else, it doesn't matter so much. So when it's forgiveness time or whatever, it's super easy to give it to others often like, oh no, they can get for, but I still have to take control of my stress and my situation because otherwise I won't survive. Mm -hmm. This, it becomes very quickly a control and self-preservation mechanism. Sure. And to the extent that it goes too far in that direction, it's profoundly unhealthy. And we should be able, otherwise, you know, we become, we become the center of the universe through our forgiveness. Yes, I offer forgiveness to you and it's fine what you do, but I'm in charge even of the forgiveness, okay little bit, you know, crazy time there. Not great. Okay. So what we need to do is realize in this season that the Savior is the one who came to forgive us all and to fill all our lives with light and love, including ourselves. And we will never do anything perfectly. We will never be able to keep ourselves safe. We will never fix the world by saying, I forgive you, but not me. Instead, we stand or kneel or whatever among all those who need to be forgiven. And we say, please forgive me for all the faults I have, known and unknown, things done and left undone. And we hear the voice saying, yes, I forgive even you. And that, from that basis, is what we're able to forgive other people, right? That's why, right. because we ourselves have been forgiven. In other words, not other people first and then us, but as if we were the host of the party, but we are forgiven and then we forgive other people. Yeah. Well, I hope you like this special episode on Thursday. Two yeah. Minute Thursday. Right. And if your holiday is stressing you out, I get it. You know, like, because everybody will say it's the same thing. Oh, holiday, it's the spirit of the, spirit of the season that mattered. But then I need to make the turkey and decorate the tree perfectly and get all the right presents and stuff like that. Okay. Ooh, exhale. Spend some time with us exhaling. Do You're, some yoga. Yeah. <laughs> do, do some cold yoga in the winter, right? Uh, but your holiday is blessed because you are loved and you are loved no matter what, not because you did everything perfectly. And if you need to forgive yourself for something this holiday season, go ahead and know that God has already forgiven you, so you have permission to. Mm -hmm. Well, if you have your own questions, we have a forum at lightofthespirit.church mm -hmm. and Twitter. At Dave Deckard. And with a D at the end. Yes. Kind of like my report card. There we go. So. <laughs> And an email. Yes, pastor at sov-id.org. Well, we will see you on a normal Tuesday, not a Thursday. And see you soon. <laughs> we'll see you soon. <laughs>